Hi, I'm Tess, and today I'm going to share with you some outfits for back to school. I'm going to be a junior in college this fall, so these are definitely things I would wear to class, but I think they're applicable for whether you're in high school or college. I never had a strict dress code in high school, so honestly I don't really know what that would entail, dressing for a dress code. If any of these outfits wouldn't satisfy your dress code, I feel like you could easily swap out a piece or add something on top. Without further ado, let's get into the outfits. I think there's 15 of them, so hope you guys enjoy. Here is the first outfit. I just paired this plaid midi skirt with my The Smiths The Queen Is Dead graphic tee, which I love the colors in this shirt with the colors in the plaid and the skirt. I think it looks really cool together. And yes, I do <laughs> like The Smiths. And for shoes, I just wore my Doc Martens. For this outfit, I'm wearing this long midi dress from J. Crew, and on top of it, I layered its red lace shirt, which I think looks really cool, and sort of dresses down this fancier dress. I just paired it with Oxfords. I think like a midi lean thing like this is always great for school because it's comfortable. You're not going to be worrying about it riding up, being too short. Love this outfit. Outfit three, I'm wearing these awesome printed linen pants that I got at TJ Maxx. I'm a huge fan of linen pants for summer and a transitional pant for fall. I think they're great. And on top, I'm just wearing this simple mock neck t-shirt and I'm wearing these platform loafers just to switch it up from my Doc Martens. So it's usually pretty hot where I live when I go back to school, so I thought I'd do an outfit with shorts. I'm just wearing my favorite shorts. These are men's jeans that I thrifted and then cut, and then I layered it with this super cute, delicate little blouse, and then I just put on this little pointel cami underneath, and my white Mary Jane Doc Martens. They're one of my favorite shoes. This outfit is if you want to feel like a character in the craft. I'm wearing my LA Apparel pleated tennis skirt, which is so back to school vibes. My little Mary Janes, black top, black sweater, and this cute necklace from Vanessa Mooney. For this next outfit, I want to show you you could style low rise pants in a way that's not aggressively 2000s. So these are a pair of trousers that I thrifted. And then this is a vintage graphic tee that was my dad's. And I'm wearing my Heaven Marc Jacobs Doc Martens, which are one of my most proud pieces. People are so afraid of low rise jeans, but guys, you don't need to be afraid. They're just pants. Next outfit, I want to play on the contrast between cargo pants, which I know are super trendy, and then pairing that with something more feminine on top. Both pieces I thrifted, the top I got at Savers, and then the bottoms are Patagonia cargos, and they're so comfortable. And then I'm just wearing my Adidas Superstars, which you'll see many times in this video. I wanted to show how you could repurpose a summer dress for school year. So this is just a little dress. It looks like Realization Par, but it's actually from Target. And then I just put a little t-shirt under it. And then again, I'm wearing my little Doc Martin Mary jeans. This outfit I call the Before Sunrise outfit because it reminds me of Julia Delphi's character's outfit in Before Sunrise. I'm wearing this long black maxi dress from Old Navy, the same little white t-shirt, which I feel like is a great hack for making any dress seem more casual. And then I'm wearing these little engineer boots. I feel like engineer boots are going to become really trendy. That's my prediction. This is how you can wear pajamas, but spice it up a little bit. What I would do is style a crew neck. This one is from Prang, but you could wear any crew neck. Instead of with like sweatpants or leggings, I paired it with this super comfortable black midi skirt. I feel like everyone should have one of these. And again, with superstars, I just think this is a jazzier way to wear something comfortable. This is what I call the Monica, because it reminds me of Monica on Friends, even though I've only seen like four episodes of Friends. I love this top. It's one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe. And then I have on one of my favorite pairs of jeans. They're the Levi's dad jeans. And then I have on, again, the loafers. You could pair it with any black shoe. And it's just cute. It's comfortable. It's slay. It's 90s. Next outfit is also, I feel like something Monica from Friends would wear, but also like very studious vibes. I'm wearing this turtleneck, a little vest, that one's from Abercrombie. I'm wearing this black skirt that I thrifted, one of my best thrift finds too, I wear it all the time. And I love the all black with just like the pop of the vest on top, I think it looks really cool. This is my definition of a sporty outfit. I have on my Heaven Baby Tee from the first collection, which was my favorite as a fan of Greg Archive films. And then this little skirt that I thrifted. You could also wear like a pair of active kind of shorts, like Adidas shorts or something. And then again, the superstars. Again, I want to play on like the more feminine top with the more masculine bottom. So I'm wearing my Dickies. This is a way, if you bought Dickies when they were super trendy, this is a way to keep wearing them. And then I just have on this really cute little top that's from Old Navy. I'm wearing these Nike sneakers that are blue, kind of tied to the blue Dickies. This is Happy Coastal Grandma for school. I'm wearing linen pants again. These ones are just white 
like I said, I love linen pants. This little sweater, and I'm wearing my Mary jeans again, and if it's too hot to wear a sweater when you go back to school, which it is where I live, you can take the sweater off and tie it around your shoulders, giving very country club. I'm a huge overall fan. I wore them a ton last year. So the ones I have are from Urban. Mine are a little like oversized, which I kind of like that look. Underneath, I'm just wearing my point out cami that I've worn a few times in this video. And then I paired it with my golf of fleurs. They're really fun shoe and I feel like a fun pop of color. Overalls are great for school because there's a lot of pockets. Another play with trousers. I wanted to show in this video alternatives for wearing jeans every day or sweatpants. A trouser like this is super comfy but also looks very put together. Then I paired it with a vintage tee. This one was my mom's. And then again, the superstars. I'm telling you guys, they're the best. I know people have been on the samba wave, but I personally prefer superstars. And that's it. Those are all my outfit ideas. I hope you guys enjoyed and got some inspiration for school. Yeah, talk to you next time.